Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP, and today we are playing Brigandine Grand Edition. This is Cross Mod version 6.1 by Aurobolos, episode 36 of our Untitled Empire campaign. And you can see just by looking at the wonderful map here that we are at the end of our campaign and we're starting Bull Noil. How is this going to break down? Uh, before I get started, we are live. I just want to say, again, I'm really appreciative of all the increase in viewership and the, we're starting to see an uptick in subscriptions. So if you're new to the channel, you like what you, you see, mash buttons, make this thing grow, make Brigandine grow. There's a Brigandine Discord engine, wiki, and subreddit. Links are going to be in the description on this YouTube video when it goes live, but I'm like 15 episodes behind on uploading, so it might be a while. I just started a new job. I just got my first vaccine. Uh, so I am in a place, man. We are sending most of our knights on quest. In fact, I can just use the location tool to explain. We got Esmeri, Gish, and Zemeckis ready to throw down against what's left of Trist. Farm XP for our weakest A-team units. Our B-team, Myra Malay Castor, is heading over to... Go confront a guy named Bone Oil. What I'm planning to do, I'll use the domain window to show, is I'm going to eliminate Escalio, and then I'm going to have an army in Baden Hills. So the very first turn Bone Oil pops up, I can get him into combat. Hopefully, what will happen is I will eliminate at least one of his two generals. I don't care which it is. Because it's my understanding that if you do that, the next turn, that general isn't there. And Bone Oil is much easier to defeat. So, I'm hoping that my, my B team can inflict some casualties, get a night kill, and be good to go. If all else fails, I can always revert. Um, I'm going to try to do this Iron Man, even though uh, I almost feel like I don't want to. So the Bull Oil fight will be Iron Man. Uh, killing off Numb Nuts will not be Iron Man. Alright, we'll see what Drist has left. And I'm in a position, I have a really rolled back backup save in case things go wrong. But you can see what they've got. We can dimension pull them. They might dimension pull us. I'd rather just melee range and just kill everything. Uh, so, attack. And we're looking to level stuff up. So, we have like a level 30 Tiamat. Uh, Esmeri can halo things. We're looking to level up our Lucifer a bit. Maybe our Vampire Lord. Our Fairies. Our breaking phoenixes which are under leveled to be honest and that's our source for healing so it's kind of complicated uh we're gonna go for it finalize attack so this is gonna be it this is gonna be the showdown and uh we'll see how it goes my cat is laying next to me in the chair that my wife often occupies attack crush them all no one gives a shit what you say yes we go first okay I'm not surprised by that it's just a fact um famine can be made into a salamander and possibly even fit into this army if necessary Assuming I don't lose Pringer, who's a level 30 Salamander. I will endeavor not to do that. Speaking of Pringer, um, we play Brigandine multiplayer on Saturday nights at 7 p.m. Eastern with uh, on Veracity Trigger's channel with him, Pringer, like I said earlier, uh, Raging Paul, and Metallic Mike. So 
so check that out, because it's PvP. There's some co-op elements, but it's PvP. We're doing the slow roll approach primarily because it's just more reliable. I don't want to get I don't want to have anything get dimensioned and pulled into oblivion and all that bullshit. When I get close enough, maybe I'll do it, but... I, mean, I could drop this fairy and easily fit a salamander. March continues. I'm sorry it's so boring. It's gonna make this video unbearably long, but you know. In a perfect world, I would find time to cut it. But then you miss all of Twitch chat's wonderful wisdom. Twitch chat, if you're there, speak up, say hi. Phoenixes don't belong in the front. Unit's just kind of running away with it, don't we? I'm waiting for one of these succubi to be like, oh, dimension time. <laughs> that would really be annoying. This castle is designed this way for a purpose. But I will never stop finding that purpose annoying. Arrange the heal. Uh, yeah, you can go there. Expedition. Almost there. This is kind of slapdash, but it's also very important for us to get our units where we need them. Considering you might get replaced with Gomez. Let's get back up to Gomez.
do have to consider that they're gonna come at me from the sea. Traditional pull? I could pull them directly with direct damage. up north for breathing or protecting. I could leave my unicorn up there. I mean, they're gonna have that thing coming through the air. Not because I'm trusting you to hold the ground. I'm gonna try to get Rosa up to 20. I don't think I can I can make the space to transform her though. Fire Dragon. Addition of React. Cat, you can just chill right here. I'm not sure how I'm gonna get that homeboy into this. The AI still does not detect any kind of threat, even though it's like, you should. Oh, look. They did. Hey, Night Hero, how are ya? Yeah, we're still good. Uh, Zemekis. Killing the centaur is nice. It's a benefit. Weakening a bunch of other units up is also nice, especially Driss, who's, let's be honest, 
going to be trouble to take down. I have a lot of magic, but not a lot of it is frost magic. I'm doing well. I'm on my second day of a new job, and I just got my first COVID shot, so I'm very happy. Here. You can kill a centaur. You level up for it. Good work. Well, look at you. Huh. Going right for the kill, huh? Death in the stupidest way possible. I knew this was coming. He is lined up for a really dangerous breath. That thing has to die this turn. Okay. Nah, I got you. That's fine. That's a good move. I ain't complaining. shot breath lined up. Special acid breath trip shot. Should be significant magic. More damage, so it should be significant. 413 XP. Not bad. Special acid breath. Take the two. Get the kill. Bad. Magic. Curse. You see face. Level 18. Should have haloed her first. Damn. Okay, that's two people linking me to the same spam bullshit. Just gonna refresh the on screen chat real quick. Really annoys me, I'm sorry about that. Oh, you know what? Could get her the halo kill with Isiphus. But it would mean killing Isiphus off this turn. And there goes all the XP from his monsters. So we're not doing that. Magic. We will halo her though. Next turn, Isiphus dies. You have 
just enough magic to do what I need you to do. To despair. You bolt, you react. I just murder this thing straight up. Oh well. Waste of XP, but... Should have saved it beforehand and been like, oh, if I'm gonna kill it, I'll back off, but... I didn't. That's my fault. Being, I guess, a lazy player. Well, let's get our healings on. Taking no chances when a pre move is at play. Don't want the risk of a meteor doom though. It's not much damage, but it's annoying. Next turn we're gonna have drift on the front lines probably. I can get rid of her now. Third army's got that covered. You know how I know? Because I have Fire Breath, one, two. That if it doesn't kill her outright, we'll leave her open to a light feather attack from this guy. So we're good. Plague I'm not worried about. Plague I'm not worried about. Okay. So then, with Zemeckis, I just went to Fury. Additional dragon. Might kill this outright. Yeah, leveled it up. Bad flack. One eleven is actually not bad. One hundred fifty three XP. Magic bolt. You. Perfect. Why the game's being laggy today, I'm sorry. Okay, so that thing's dead no matter what, which is what I wanted. And now we're gonna run into problems continuing the game. Kind of six one half dozen of the other. Fire breath, fire breath, burning things to death. Level twenty three. Gish doesn't need experience, so he can. 
cast react on something. What do I want to react for next turn? Yeah, I'll make her uh, a nuclear bomb. Isophis has to be like, what did I do to myself? That's unpleasant. Stabity 191. Poison. Ooh, self heal. Good call. By that I mean a bad call. Now you're taking up spot on the front line. That's adorable. If it works, I'm gonna heal it. It worked. Just gotta give it that. Oh, it's a green attack, huh? Yeah, missed. No, it's green, but enjoy triple blue. When you walk into the ocean. And you don't even challenge it. Drift is gonna be such a problem. They left the spot open. Oh, Valgos, look out, buddy! Ouch! Alright, we have two major threats on our front. This thing's just annoying. I think, uh, Holy Word is in order. does have a golem on the field. It is Fist needs to die this turn. Do I default to a bolt? I'm trying to kill this thing. It's got a blue and a green orb. Bolt might work. The bolt this though. This if this dies. as well. I also have Death Breath with the Tiamat. Fire with the Phoenixes. I don't heal. Maybe heal, fire. Depends on the turn order too, you know, like I can't predict that. So we're gonna single target Frost you. Actually, I lied. Talked about pumping her up to 20. Special acid breath, go. How level is this thing, six? Frost, react. So I need both my reacts. 
but I can make this work. Single target frost. One ninety five, that's it. Curse is not gonna do it. It's got a custodian. Resist this what? That's not that's irrelevant. Try for 273. 236. Just a little short. You know what would work, though? You know what really might do the trick? I'm sorry, we're perseverating on the same old stuff. If I use Bolt instead. No, not on you. Bolt has significantly more power. Magic Curse. This thing. Stonian looted, 700 XPs. Magic, react. You. Magic, halo. You. Magic, react. You magic last one of the day. Curse, kill him. One ninety five. Tango down. Dots, dots, dots. Level twenty. Where's another turn to go? Might as well Venom Drist if you can. Will it work? Probably not. It's not gonna kill him, but it's gonna be experience. Special fire breath, you. I wish Drist had been able to go and get killed on the Lilith as well, but kill that, hurt Drist pretty bad, and then kill that, hurt that kind of bad. So it's like a one kill move, but it'll hurt Drist a lot. And that's what matters here. 85, 60s. Barely enough to kill it. Yeah, I don't know if Atisha is gonna get hospitalized or not. Not in position to react anything. Uh, I am not in position to do much of anything. 
Gina Bolt. Yeah. It hurts, Drist. Kind of in Drist has to die territory, aren't we? I mean, his Meteor Doom won't hurt much. It's probably what he'll do next. So Night Hero heals Valkos, and Valkos fires the end. killer. I can't just move my team out up and melee this chick. And that might do it. Uh, I don't know. It's tough. Tough choices. Better bow shot. That makes things easier. Run, save state, save two. Going claw, 145. It should, she should have it. Well, Balcos is not easy, so Balcos should have it. Oh, no healing song. Magic heal. Falcos. He took 200 hit points of damage and he's about to take more. If AI predictability is a thing. Magic heal. This 500 hit point dragon. I'm gonna make this work. I feel like I legitimately have no idea what to do with this guy. I guess just kill Paralyze or Risk. So his Meteor Doom is just gonna be like, man, you're annoying. If he does 100 on anything, I'll be surprised. Even 100, I'm surprised. Wow, he's actually doing like consistent hundreds here. So you're arranging yourselves to be slaughtered. You already poisoned it. <laughs> what more are you gonna do? See, that's smart. If you hit, there's no retail. The EMS, so. That's a good call, single target frost and a fire dragon. One more time, we're gonna save state. We're gonna try to farm as much experience as we can off these fools. What does that mean? Means we gotta burn them, obviously. Night hero, get the kill. Close. Do I need to heal anything? Famine is pretty hurt. Let's 
600 just can easily melee him down to like 350. If I need some indirect fire on just have Divine Right, he's toast. Shot Driss just to piss him off. 22, not bad. So five, perfect. Magic Fury. Confident that was the best move, necessarily. I'm not unconfident that was the best move. We're gonna start playing fast and loose here with our offense. Alright, you know what? We're gonna reload. I have an idea. Oops, too late now. Uh, okay, Gish. Magic. Fury of this dude. Two twenty-four. Nope, close, but no cigar. Say two. level 23. 73% hit chance. 230 HP, dead. 300 HP, good. What's next? Magic. I can divine ray two times. That should be all I need to finish Drist. I'm actually going to save it to make sure that I don't finish him off. Although if I do, it's not the end of the world. Ooh, one Divine Ray, huh? So instead, we're going to Light Feather him. Ninety-six, not nearly as effective. Clever idea. It's only going to require most of my magic. Yeah, play gets big heals. Special Acid Breath. All three of these. All right, got a kill.
kind of pin him in. Oh, I can shield him? Whatever. I almost want to send her into melee. I don't want to send it in melee. Drist is gonna be like, well, I'm not even attacking. Ice fall on a blue elemental creature. Great call. Really gonna work. Tell you there's level one giant over there. This will need some damage, but nothing will fundamentally change. boxing the schmuck in. Can I mute? Nope. Forty four percent. Good promise this one would be long. Can you do one ninety five? Crit 226, tango down. Level 15, baby. Uh, no, we'll see if anyone needs healing first. Plague definitely needs healing. Stardust is sort of trapped in the back here. Excuse me. 
Who do I want to fury up then? Or actually. I have an idea. Alright, so I'm stuck on grass now. That's fine. 96! That's my wife coming home. Hello, honey. Hi, my mom's here. She's gonna help me with the air conditioner. Okay. Um, I'll be down in a bit. Yes, it's fine. That's so what you're saying is we need to kill Faticia. A 90 and we miss? Really? I get the feeling we're going to be going another turn. Magic, mute, tryst. Might not work, it might. on this project. I don't have healing word, do I? Nope, I don't. But I do have single target heal on this guy. gonna die this turn. Yeah. She is feeding us experience. In your case, I need to heal you. I don't care who gets the kill, kill is unimportant. Single target Venom on Asmari. Very bold. The one I couldn't fury go first because this one that could fury might do too much. Almost dead. Tishy's dead. Brian at looted. Good, great. Am 
magic cure poison thing just for the sake of curing the poison thing. Alright. And now the finale. The divine ray. I did well over 200 last time I tried it, so let's see how this goes. 294. Drist goes down in flames. Level 17. We are victorious. Stardust levels up, and that's it. So I'm going to wrap this video here. Uh, I have some helping out to do. But I want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit the like, share, subscribe, and follow whatever buttons. It really does help the channel grow. It lets me know what you're watching so I can keep making more of it. And I really do appreciate it from the very bottom of my heart. Again, I am on Twitch, Twitter, YouTube, Discord. All of those good things. Uh, there's a bringing Discord engine, subreddit, and wiki. All good stuff. My wife is apparently having a fun time. And... Uh, I gotta go, <laughs> but as always on this channel, pieces.